if I'm gonna post this, but. <laughs> hey guys, so it's been a minute. When is the last time I posted? I don't even know, but I'm gonna try to post more. I don't know why I've not posted in so long. So today I'm gonna be going to the mall with some friends. I'm not sure exactly who's coming yet, but I got all ready. I did my hair yesterday. If you can't tell, like now the curls are like hella loose, but I did my hair yesterday. I did my makeup today. I'm all ready. So yeah, I don't know why I have not posted in so long. Like I've literally just not have posted. Like I don't have any ideas for videos. And I'd tell you guys to comment some suggestions, but my comments are disabled still. I don't I don't know. I don't know. Kinda of pissed about that, but what am I gonna do about it? Nothing. So I've been watching some YouTube lately and it got me thinking. I had a channel. I have a whole channel with like almost 9,000 subscribers. Why am I not posting? I don't know. How many times am I gonna mention that I haven't posted in like 50 years? We get it. Oh my god, wait. So I got these lights yesterday. It looks so much prettier on camera. What the f It looks way more blue and like not as pretty in person to be honest, but on camera it looks so pretty. Yeah, I'm obsessed. I'm obsessed. I'm obsessed. I don't really know what to say. So I guess when I have something to say, I'll be back. Okay, I don't know what to wear and it's really pissing me off. Everything makes me look like a box. Boring ass fit, but... I give up. Hot girls, I'm gonna have hot girls. It's so f***ing cold. I'm back. So I got these jeans and I'm not entirely sure how I feel about them. I forgot to vlog in the mall. Why does this camera make me look so much uglier? Like, oh my god. So this is my old room where I used to film my YouTube videos. If you guys remember embarrassing times why does it look so yellow i think that looks better now time for a little story time because i just were posting about how i had a seizure okay wait no not but people are saying i had a seizure in school which i did not so on the second last day of school so which was thursday i was walking back from the washroom and i was going to class and i felt kind of nauseous but i just like brushed it off i didn't really think anything of it and then i sat down in class and we're watching a movie i don't really know what happened like i was fine like the nauseousness went away i don't know if that meant anything but i felt fine and then i was reaching for my bag i honestly don't remember what i was trying to get but i was just like reaching for my bag which was on the floor next to my desk and then i just fell off my chair and i passed out for like for like two seconds like i was just like gone for like two seconds now that i think about it it's really funny because like i really don't know what happened okay, i looked to my right and then my teacher's there i felt like the whole class was staring at me and i was so embarrassed because i was like like i don't know what just happened like i just fell off of my chair and they were probably confused too but like i was so confused like i had no idea what was happening like, my teacher was like holding on to me so i wouldn't fall out of my chair again which at that moment, like, I felt fine. And then the teacher went and told another student to call 911, I think, or, like, call an ambulance or something. And I was like, I do not need a whole ambulance. I just passed out. I'm okay. I understand they're just trying to make sure that, like, nothing happened because, like, I'm in school. So that's what they're supposed to be doing. But I knew I was fine. And then so my teacher and some other teacher just, like, kind of, like, escorted me out of the class into another empty class. And a few minutes later, the paramedics just walk into the class and they're like talking to me. They like stuck some stuff onto me and like connected it to some machine and was like running tests. I was fine and they said I was fine. But then they wanted to take me to the hospital, like the paramedics wanted to take me to the hospital. And 
I was like, I don't know how to go to the hospital. And I did not want to make more of a scene than they already did. My dad came, because obviously I have to, they have to call my parents. So then my dad came and they were talking and they said that they highly recommend that I go to the hospital, whether it's in the ambulance, which I did not want to go into the ambulance. I knew I was fine. I did not want to go into the ambulance. But then my dad really wanted me to go to the hospital too. So my dad took me to the hospital. They finally called my name and they like made me change into a hospital gown. And they like stuck stuff all over the front of my body. And yeah, like the tests came back and we were like, I was fine. I was fine. I knew I was fine. My battery's flashing. Anyways. Let me wrap up this story. But it really pissed me off because people were calling me and texting me saying like, oh my God, you had a seizure? And I was like, no. Okay, that sounded really bad. I wasn't trying to say, in this clip, I wasn't trying to say that I was annoyed that people were calling me and texting me like, thank you for being worried and thank you for like asking about me. I was just annoyed at the fact that people were saying that I had a seizure. I didn't, but even if I did, that's none of your business. Even if you posted saying like, oh, this girl just fainted, like that's none of your business. You shouldn't be posting that. That has nothing to do with you. Anyways, thanks for listening to my, oh, to my little story time about the time that I didn't have a seizure. I simply fainted. Oops, I forgot to continue recording. I completely forgot that I had a whole video today. Just filming on my phone because I'm too lazy to get up and go get the camera all the way over there. All the way over there. Not, no, I can't. I think I'm gonna sleep soon because I feel like shit and I look busted, but don't mind that. Oh, I took a shower. If you can't tell, my hair is no longer curly. Sad. I hope you guys enjoyed this little video. Honestly, don't know what this is. I just wanted to film something because I've not filmed in so long.